All right, I wanna thank you for downloading the pregnancy food checklist. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk you through how to use the Excel version as well as the Google Sheets version. So what we're seeing here is the Excel version. Um, you'll have three tabs, week one, week one print, and week one example. And I'll go through each of these with you. So this first one is if you're gonna be doing this like on your um, PC, laptop, you could also do it on your uh, tablet, uh, iPad, your phone, if you have Excel, mobile Excel on those devices. But anyways, basically how this works is um, on this side, you have each day of the week, and then up here are the different food items that you'll be tracking. So for example, on Monday, if you did drink six to 10 glasses of water, what you would do is you would just enter a one here and it's gonna put a check mark in there for you. Let's say on Tuesday, you only got four glasses. So then you would just put a zero there and it would give you an X. Um, and you would do that for each and every one of these. Same as with these bottom ones. If you got two portions of fish um, that week, then you would do a one. And let's say you didn't work out. You would get a, you'd put a zero there and you'd get that. Um, once you have this all filled out, this would work for all of these different cells. You just click this button, it'll clear it for you so that you can start over for the next week. Um, this other one here is if you want to print it so that you can just have it on the go or you just want to do it with you know paper and pen, you can do that. You would just click this button here and if you have a printer set up, you'll hear it in the background printing, it'll just print this for you. Um, and then here's just an example so that you can kind of see what it looks like when it's all said and done based off of uh, how your week went. Okay, all right, so that is the Excel version. And the, <clears throat> the Google Sheets version is pretty much the same thing, except Google Sheets doesn't have icons for, uh, for us to be able to use, so we're just color coding these for you. So it would work the exact same way. So if you come here and you put a one, it'll go green that you did it. If you do a zero, it'll go red. All right, and then to clear these, and I'll just do one here as well, and then one here as well, just so I can show you. So in Google Sheets, to be able to clear this and start over for the, the next week, you would just basically grab, you know, just left click here, drag your mouse over, and then just hit the delete key, and it'll delete all of those values. On these ones, just go to each one and hit delete, and it'll start it over for you. In Google Sheets, to print this, you'll go file, print, and I'm not gonna print this again, oh, and we'll fix that, but. Uh, you just go here and you'll go next and follow the tutorial and it'll print it for you. <clears throat> and then here is an example of what it will look like when it's all said and done. Well, we hope that you enjoy using this free pregnancy food checklist. Uh, if you want any other great advice, just head over to she'sgotaplanner.com. Thanks. Have a great day.